we may have to readjust um, how we're doing this. So this is uh, improving and extending retrospective outcomes. Um, so this is a beginner, is, is billed as a beginner session. So I'm going to be going over some things that um, many of you may already know about retrospectives. So you do keep that in mind. I mean, that's what I'm going to do. How many, how many here have only learned about retrospect, yeah, have either not learned about retrospectives before or only learned about them through scrum training? Okay. How many of you have done additional looking at retrospectives on your own besides that? Okay. That will help me a little bit. I might be able to move through some of this pretty quickly. That one? <laughs> You're going to be, this is going to be fun. <laughs> You're just going to be there doing the, setting me up for the next thing. Um, my name's Diana Larson, and um, along with Esther Derby, I wrote the first book about um, using retrospectives for Agile. There actually was a book before us by a guy named Norm Kurth called Project Retrospectives, a Handbook for Team Reviews, um, or Project Reviews. It, uh, his book was about, uh, his book came out, it was written in the late 90s when people were still on four and five year projects with multi hundreds of people or whatever. And so it was really intended as a way at, at the end of those projects to capture learning. So Esther and I um, noticed that there was some interest in retrospectives happening more frequently. And so in his retrospectives, the way he describes the retrospectives in his book, they're three days long. So we sort of knew that wasn't going to work in a two-week sprint. So we said, how do these things need to be rejiggered so that it is useful on a more frequent cadence. So that's why we wrote the Agile Retrospectives book. For a long time, it was the only book. It's not anymore. There are um, a couple of two or three other books and some other resources that I'm going to point you to when we get to the end. Uh, Pat Kua has written a book that's actually not so much about the designing like this session is going to be or that our book is about it's not so much about designing retrospectives or that, but more about the role of the facilitator. And so if you're interested in improving.